We introduce a language-grounded pre-training for 3D semantic segmentation on a new 3D segmentation benchmark. Popular 3D semantic segmentation benchmarks like ScanNet contain many indoor scans. Their focus, however, is confined to a limited number of categories and lacks the diversity required to evaluate segmentation methods in real-world situations. To bridge this gap and help advance the development of useful 3D segmentation techniques, we created a segmentation benchmark on ScanNet that evaluates against a large number of diverse fine-grained categories. ScanNet 200 introduces an order of magnitude more categories than its predecessor, and thus reveals the natural class imbalance that exists in real-world scenes. For example, chairs and desks are much more common than soap dishes. To analyze performance on this new task, we split the categories into head, common, and tail categories based on their frequency of appearance. Geometric feature learning with imbalanced labels leads to poor representations. We propose to enhance the learned representations by aligning them to a semantically rich feature space of a language encoder. Using a pre-trained clip model, we extract feature embeddings for ScanNet 200 categories and use them as target features to guide learned 3D features in a 3D point-to-language contrastive objective. Once pre-trained under language guidance, we fine-tune the models for the downstream task of semantic segmentation. This results in additional performance improvement. Comparing our pre-training procedure to current state-of-the-art 3D pre-training method contrastive scene context, we are able to consistently improve performance over all splits. Qualitative comparisons highlight our improved segmentation performance overall and in particular for rare categories and small objects. As the number of categories increases, annotation efforts become more difficult, emphasizing the need to evaluate in settings with reduced supervision. When only 5% of labeled data is available, our language-guided pre-training produces significant improvements over baseline alternatives. Thank you for your attention.